Hello, everybody. Ultra Mario here, and welcome back to some more Mario Kart Tour. All right, Daisy Farmer. My favorite Daisy ults, honestly. She's so cool. Bro, oh, no, 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 I was so close. Damn, that sucks. Next thing here. Uh, first we gotta do this though. Good job, Mario. Alright, who we got now? Yoshi? Yeah. 
Yo, that's just what I wanted. And yeah, it's somehow just not doing anything for me. How does that not hit that guy? Serious? Hold on. Okay, I'm good now. Sorry about that. Mason, huh? Reminds me of a friend, though. No. Toad? Captain Toad is going at it, dude. Me. Okay, you know what? Screw you, dude. Hold up.
Alright, glider challenge thing. Bro, it's Santa. What is he doing in May? How jolly. in the present box. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, what do we got now? Uh, I don't know. Rosalina, I guess. The way she says it is so weird. She's just like, Tanuki! Tanuki! Okay. What the? Are you kidding me? That sucks. Also, why did he use this common coin box there? Is he stupid or something? Okay, these matches are cursed. The map shape looks like a funny mouth or something. I don't know. It's a creature. These all look cool in the pumpkin. Okay, 
That was a bad idea. What is going on right now? What is happening? Bro, I'm gonna freaking lose it. Daisy is at her limit right now. Just, just kill everyone with the shell. Alright, cool. No way I'm catching up to those guys, but... I mean, I did alright. Bro, what? Bro, what? Oh, hey there, Flaxer. How's it going, man? I didn't see you there. I had to jump off the race screen to see you. What's up, dude? Yeah, thigh, thigh, is it Ty or Thigh? I don't know. Ty Daisy's cool, though. I really like that, uh, costume. Oh, wait, I see why you like her. Kick. Anyway. We got, uh, Roy Koopa, I guess. I'm a shell. I just use the highest level points, and that's good enough for me. Sorry. That was probably too much. I'm just a big silly. Alright, we got Roy Koopa here. Also, I saw a bit of your multiverse stream. The game looks pretty crazy. I might try to get back into it, but I don't know. I just didn't really vibe, like, vibe vibe with it when I played it last time, so... I don't know. If they do make the speed a bit better, uh, maybe I'll like it more. I, honestly, I, it wasn't so much that the characters move slow, it's just the jumps just felt way too floaty for me. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. I'm just vibing. I would play Paper Mario today, but I got hard drive problems lately. My freaking external drive is just failing, and I'm trying to, like, salvage it to see if I can, like, fix it. So, that's a lot of fun, but otherwise, I'm hanging in there. That's good that you're having fun with it, though. Wow. Freaking... Stupid drivers over here. Yippee! That cat car kind of looks ugly, I'm not gonna lie. I don't like the, like, beige kind of... Uh, I don't know. Whatever it is. Skin color cat. Snap a photo. Alright. You know what? Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, see, for me, I, like, I don't think it's the worst thing I ever played. It's alright, but I don't know if I can, like, vibe with it. But I did have some fun with the game, so I wouldn't lie. I wouldn't say I'm lying there. Like, I thought, I, I just think, to be fair, like, half the characters weren't really for me. I like Taz, because he's, like, basic and funny, but, oh, whoops. I didn't really do that right. Yeah, I'm a Taz scrub. Sue me. But, um, let's see. Who else did I like? I don't even remember, honestly. I'm basic, so I, I like Shaggy, I guess. He was fun. Um, I think I remember Superman being kind of cool. Alright, I gotta wait for them. Uh, it still annoys me that they never added winning Bowser, but they added winning Peach and Mario. Like, they have both of them there. 
But they didn't do anything. Like, come on, man. My only guess as to why would be because they already added Dr. Bowser who has a similar, like, he has the same shirt, shoes, and hairstyle, but... Oh wait, no, he doesn't have the same hair, but still. Yeah, that's fair. It's like me when with certain Sonic games. Like, I acknowledge that there's problems, but I vibe enough with it well that I don't really care about the problems that much. Like, they're there, but I'm like, you know, this is fine. And I guess the same thing with, like, Sonic Origins or Mario 3D All-Stars or something. Like, I really genuinely don't think the Ghost games are that bad, as people say. Like, yeah, they do have some problems. They could be better, yeah. But, no, they're perfectly acceptable ways to, you know, experience these games now. Like, I don't know, man. Like, am I yelling at people for... Am I yelling at... People for, you know, Nintendo being stupid with 3D All-Stars release? No, like, yeah, they were stupid. But I don't think the collection itself is a genuinely a bad offer. I thought it was pretty good. Maybe it could be a little bit less pricey, considering it didn't even have, like, an art book or anything special like Mario Maker did, but I don't think it was that bad of a price. Asking point. I don't know. Same with Skyward Sword HD. Like, yeah, they, they could have done more, but at the same time, it's an accessible way to play the game. Like, I don't know, man. People are weird with pricing stuff sometimes. Like, Sonic Superstars, people are like, oh, it's a, a 2D platformer that's mid. Uh, it's not worth $60. I mean, I wouldn't be upset if it were less money, but at the same time, I don't care that it's 60 I don't know, man. If I like a Sonic game enough, I will buy it if it's, you know, reasonable enough, anyway. And not an absolute ripoff. Because I like Sonic. I don't know, man. I just vibe. Oh, yeah. I might stream the, um, 358, uh... I don't know if you saw it. There's, like, a Melon DS patch for the emulator that, like, basically makes the controls good. And I... I, I it might be the best way to play that game. I'm actually interested in the idea of playing 358 right now. I don't know. Like, it seems pretty cool. Like, you got proper analog control, uh, proper, um, like, camera control with the right stick. The, um, you know, the command menu is mapped to the D-pad, like it should be. Basically, anything you would want with the controls in that game is better. And, you know, optimized for, you know, regular controller. And that's cool. Bruh, she kind of like bugged out over there. Daisy with the pride col colors in her uh, course logo. Yeah, that's fair. I'm not, like, justifying the poor choices, but it's more so that I don't care that much. You know? It's an- it's- it's just annoying to deal with certain gamers sometimes when they're like, Oh, blah blah blah, and I'm like, yeah, I don't care. Like, valid criticism, but like, I don't care, man. I'm just getting this game.
Kinda reminds me of the people that are annoying about Kingdom Hearts 3. Like, Kingdom Hearts 3 is not that bad. Chill out, man. I mean, I haven't played the game yet, but I, 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 I sincerely doubt I'll have that much problems with it. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I, you know, hear most often about it. I'm gonna pick it up before Kingdom Hearts 4 at least, but it comes out, but I just don't know when. I'm just sad I couldn't really vibe with Dream Drop like I wanted it to. Like, I wanted to like that game, I don't know. It's just kind of a, um, like weird for me, I guess. Like, it's not bad, but it's not good either. It's in like a weird in-between. I don't know my feelings on that game. Also, I have the opinion of somebody who likes to clear out all the rooms with every heart list for fun. I thought re re chain of memories was a bit much for me personally, but you know, I'm not a normal Kingdom Hearts player, so that's probably not, you know, the most valid opinion or anything like that, of course. But I mean, in, in normal chain of memories, it's manageable for me, so. To me, the best part of re chain was the bosses. I thought they were really cool. Yeah. Steam release stuff sounds cool. I hope they make a PS5 version so I can, like, play the games with some enhancements. Assuming they actually let me get the version for free, because I like when they do that, but they don't always do that. I don't know if Square does that. But, you know, that'd be cool. Because it is just the same collection again, but with better textures or something. It irks me just as much as the new, you know, PS5 version of Persona 5 that they just released, but they don't have an upgrade for. And they let you have all the DLCs that I didn't even get to play when I played the game. So I'm like, bro, I could have been playing Peak Persona 5 with costumes and stuff that Persona 4 has by default, by the way. But of course, they have to make all of that, like, DLC stuff that I have to pay for, and I'm like, I don't care. I like that in Persona 4, like, the costumes are kind of price hard to get or pricey or whatever in the game itself, but you don't have to actually buy any DLC to get it. Like, I don't know. And Persona 3, at least there's like some stuff. Like, I don't know. You can get... But, like, nothing crazy right now. I feel like the, all the interesting outfits are probably locked behind DLC. Mostly. Alright, another battle, huh? Kill them. Damn it. Okay, I could have avoided that, but I didn't because I'm silly. It's so freaking... it takes forever to kill people on this map.
At least in this, you know, Mario Kart Tour, where battle mode is way slower. Because they have to accommodate for this control scheme. I... Okay, this battle is dragging on way too long. True. Yeah, I got the P5 sounds. I'm a, I'm a nerd like that. Also, my phone ringtone is still the freaking Corona Plant Parade from Mario Wonder because I just never felt like changing it. Although I should probably make a Thousand Year Door theme at this point. Same with my message sound, honestly. Whenever I vibe with the game enough, I just make that the, the sound of my phone. Right. Dang, I'm still getting coins here. Hold up. Oh, this reddish card looks funny. Oh, in this version, the car, the cars are not maniacs. No, screw off, Peach. Bro, I swear to God, with these freaking items today. Okay. Angry. The CPUs can be really annoying sometimes. I wonder why that car has a giant surfboard on it. I'm guessing that's probably the last one, but I don't know. Alright, thank you all so much for watching the stream. And have yourselves a good one. If you like what you saw, feel free to follow and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Links on the sidebar. I post all my Twitch broad content there. Including a ton of other stuff, such as lots more Mario, Sonic, Pizza Tower, and more. I also have a Discord server where you can chat and see all the newest stream updates. Anyway, have a good one and see ya.